Hi, my name is Chris Gamble, and I'm running KaiCon on behalf of my company, Analog Life LLC. I'm really excited that we're going to be coming up on that real fast. It's about two and a half weeks away here. So today we're going to be talking about the schedule a little bit, some of what we've got planned for the conference, and then some final logistics pieces for uh, getting you at KaiCon. Hopefully you want to be attending it. So let's take a look here. So uh, the KaiCon site is here. Um, we uh, obviously do have still have tickets left. We are running close on uh, Early bird tickets. So if you click here, buy tickets, take it over to this page. Early bird tickets are are no more after April 15th. So get your tickets by April 15th in order to get the early bird prices. Then they go up to 125. Uh, but the thing that you probably care about more is the schedule. So we now announced the schedule here. Um, so we're going to have two tracks. We have uh, the main event space and a large classroom. And then we also have a small classroom. We're going to be doing uh, some workshops here. And that's something we had previously not announced. So doors open 8.30. Please don't come before then. Um, but then we're going to breakfast in the morning. We'll welcome you. We have some uh, anything in neon green here are the keynotes. And then we go into our normal talks after that. Like I said, we will be having a beginner workshop. So if you're not, uh, you know, if you are on the fence, you're like, well, I don't use KaiCA that much, or I just got started with it. This is going to be a great opportunity for you to do that. The beginner workshop will actually go into a milling workshop in the afternoon as well. So basically, begin, uh, beginners will be able to not only make a, a design in KaiCAD, but you'll also be able to use Bantam Tools, one of our sponsors, but to use their, their tools. Uh, our, one of our speakers, Sean Heimel, is also giving some, uh, some workshops here. Uh, as, well as well as Barry. And uh, so basically, those two things together, you'll be able to have a working uh, PCB at the end of the day, hopefully. We'll also be at M Hub. So, M Hub is the space uh, where we're going to be having the conference. It's actually a co working space in Chicago, Illinois. That uh, they're also one of our sponsors, and uh, <laughs> they're going to be giving tours of the space. So it's about 60,000 square feet of co-working space, workshops, and everything like that. Lots of fun toys to go in and gawk at, including a pick and place machine. Uh, so then throughout the throughout the day, we'll be doing uh, talks. Like I said, workshops on the right here. Have a couple breaks. Uh, at the end of the day, Wayne, the project lead for KiCad, will be giving a, a keynote about the state of KiCad and where we are and where we're going. And then we're going to have all the developers up on stage so you can ask them questions about. Um, you know, different things you you want to see or that you like in KiCad, you can actually talk to the developers directly and hear them discuss with one another here. And then finally, after that, on Friday, we'll be going over to Pumping Station One, which is one of the local hacker spaces, and we'll be having an event over there that evening with dinner and everything like that. Next day, much of the same, we'll be having opening uh, opening remarks. Uh, Michael Osman will be giving a talk then, uh, and then we'll move into a manufacturer panel. So a lot of our sponsors are manufacturers, so either PCB manufacturers or assembly houses. Uh, and so we'll be asking them about you know best practices for when you're when you're giving when you're uh, trying to go towards towards production. I think that KiCad is is rapidly uh, becoming a, a industry accepted tool, and I I use it professionally as well. I think that uh, and talking to the manufacturers will get a better feel for for what uh, what they're looking for and ways to improve the tool in that way. Then more talks throughout the day. Uh, Anul uh, will be giving a, a 3D modeling workshop. And uh, so that's for if you're, you know, if you want to use the 3D functions in uh, in KiCad, I think it's really useful. I think that's one of the, the best things that's happened to KiCad. I, I use that a lot in my in my use as well. Again, we'll have lunch, some more talks, and then we'll be having the layout contest as well. So this will have a couple of different categories. We're still working out. We're thinking things like fastest layout, cleanest layout, most obscure layout, that kind of thing. And we'll have more details about that. And then finally, at the end of the day, we'll have one more keynote and then a workflow panel with all the people that are kind of talking about best practices for getting KiCad, for using KiCad on a, on a regular basis and pulling things like scripting engines and, and things like that. Finally, we'll be having a uh, Hackaday. We'll be sponsoring an event uh, at a local pub. And we'll, uh, we'll be going over there for dinner and hanging out and bringing a hack. On Thursday night before the event starts, we'll also be having a, uh, bring, uh, a meetup for hardware developers, or just really anyone can show up, uh, but basically bring your project, show them off in a similar manner to the Hackaday event. Uh, let's see. So we've got workshops. We've got uh, we've got workshops. We've got talks. We've got meals. We've got lots of things going on here. Uh, the last thing that is required is for you to show up. So if you're interested, uh, we hope you do decide to come to KiCad or KaiCon rather. Um, it's happening April 26th and 27th here in Chicago. There are still tickets for sale, and we'd love to see you there. If you have any questions, you can always uh, send an email to faq at kicad-kicon.com. Uh, that email should be on the uh, website as well, and the website is kicad-kicon.com. Thanks a lot, and I'm looking forward to seeing you April 26th and 27th in Chicago.